Um, this video is concerning two things. One, um, I will be making a response video to my last tutorial on SRCDS GMod Server. Uh, I got a lot of people that didn't know how to uh, uh, port forward, so I am going to uh, take care of that in my next video. All I need you to do is comment on this video what your brand of router is so that I know what you know what router most people have and then I can just give a link to a website where you can find all the other routers uh, on the internet. Okay, so second thing um, is a little tip that I found. Uh, it's a way for those that already have your server online or for ones that do a LAN server. Um, it's just a little uh, program that you write um, that automatically updates your server so you never have to type in a command again. Okay, what you need to do is uh, right click your desktop, uh, new, and never mind. Uh, I use, you can use Notepad, I actually use uh, Notepad++, uh, which is just better laid out for your coding stuff. C++, stuff like that. If it'll load. Okay. This is not what we want. Okay. So. is uh, gmod server update um, and then you want to make it a uh, batch file and you just save that to your desktop and then all you have to do is type in the command uh, which if you already know all you need, it's two lines of code, and you just save it, and uh, when you run it, uh, this is the one that we just made, when you run it, it will automatically come up with uh, the update for it. So you never have to type that in again after you create that little program, and I found it pretty helpful. So, yeah, uh, comment on this video your router brand, and uh, in about two or three weeks I'll get back to you and uh, make a new video further explaining uh, the installation if you had trouble with it before. So thanks for watching.